Hello, everybody, and welcome to Mad Max. That's right. I'm playing Mad Max. It is like a two-year-old game or something like that. I can't remember what year this came out. I think it came out in 2015. But uh, I've been wanting to play it for the channel for a while. I have beaten this game before, but I can't remember any of it, and I don't believe I ever played it on the PC. So this should be fun. So, uh, yeah. Anybody who knows anything about the Mad Max franchise will know, uh, or probably has already played this, but you know what? I just, I wanted to play it. It was gonna happen regardless. Alright, so, we're gonna get some water. Uh, there, I, I mean, I am skipping pretty much the entirety of the, uh, the stupid, well, it's not stupid. But, uh, I, I did skip the entirety of the beginning of the... I'm trying to pay attention. Alright, anyway, uh, don't... Led me right so far. Gotta find it. Don't get addicted to water. Don't get addicted to water! You'll regret when it's gone, or some, something like that. It's something like that, okay? Anybody who's seen Fury Road will know what I'm talking about. But this game is by far, um, I mean, uh-oh, it's, it's an insanely fun game, uh, that just kind of got overlooked by a lot of things. Uh, I know when it, when it came out, oh, it's Chum Bucket, great. Uh, when it came out, this game did pretty well, but they never did DLC, they never did anything for it yet. Start to blaze my godly plug ignite. Revolution about revolution rejoice! Please, don't kill Chum Bucket! Please! Hey! <laughs> just, just a little black finger named Chum Bucket! Oh, please don't kill Chum Bucket! The long lookers. They left you for the blowflies, and they snatched your ride, and now you'll be looking to snatch it back. That's what the prophecy says. You're the driver. Uh huh, right. yeah. I, I love Chumbo yeah, yeah. I'm your man. Yeah. He's, uh, yes, he's got to be one of my favorite characters. Yep, for Black Finger. I think I called him a Black Thumb. I keep saying the wrong thing. Like, I called him a Black Hand at some point, and I was like, wait, that's. That's, uh, oh, oh. Elder Scrolls. I me and dismantle me. I know. Chum bucket's not stupid. But yeah, I mean, th this has a lot of really cool vehicle combat. And while the while the little missions and stuff like that do get a little tedious from time to time, uh, I mean, it's still an incredibly fun game. And anybody who's a fan of Mad Max should be one to just play it so oh, much. Bleeding out. I can fix it, but I do my best work in my sanctum. Close the car. I need wire to fix my buggy. But then I can show you where they took the black on black. Ah, we the interceptor. Up that path. But, but before you go, grab some grit, Saint. You must be running on fumes. All right. Sounds good. I'm just going to eat this uh, dog food over here. I mean, that sounds like a good idea, right? Dinky D. Meat and veggies. All right, sweet. So, uh... Well, I mean, I was just about to say, the food in this game ranks from disgusting to downright making me want to puke everywhere, but, you know, it works. All right, so I got to get used to an Xbox controller because when I played this before, it was on the PS4. And uh, I didn't have that, so uh, I get two shotgun shells. All right, uh, climb. Well, yeah, I know how to climb. Okay, such a fracking fat. Sure, sounds like fun. Oh, hello. Okay, so I need to aim and then hit. Oh, shit. That's not what I wanted to do. Like I said, gotta get <laughs> gotta get used to gotta get used to uh, the game controls and everything. I probably could have blocked that guy, uh, but what? Excuse me. Who's calling me names? I'm gonna come over there and I'm gonna kick your ass. Another one. Fun's not over yet, boys. 
Okay, to strike an enemy, to parry an enemy. Okay, cool. Like, the, the combat's actually pretty fun, too. Like, it's got, like, Batman-style combat where you kind of go between enemies and you can, like, block enemies and all kinds of stuff. And, uh... Ooh, hello. Heavy strike! There we go. Nicely done. Just knock him the fuck right out. There we go. Just punch him right in the back. There we go. Nice. But this game, like I said, I, I cannot get enough of this game. I can't get it. It's so good. It's so good. Okay. Location info. Oh, okay. So you can get the info there. So it looks like there's two pieces of scrap and I'm missing one. So where is the last piece of scrap that I have? I've got to find that... As a collector, I have to collect all the things. But I'm guessing the scrap might be... Where the hell's the other scrap? It's got to be somewhere. Ah, there it is. Thank you. I'll take that. And I also have all the DLC for it, which were basically vehicle things. And it's it, it, it makes me sad that these guys never made any DLC. So the question is, is Warner Brothers, why haven't you either made another game or in the spirit of Mad Max uh, created some DLC? Because I'd actually buy the DLC for this game if they would release it. Like, we never went to Gastown. I think Gastown's a place that... Oh, no, no, no. We do, do, we do go to Gastown, but uh, both in Fury Road and in... This game, we never go to the bullet farm. Ah, there's the mysterious. You are not ready. Why? Oh. Who are you, mysterious man? Is he the merchant from Resident Evil 4? What you buying? What you selling? That's a, I, I honestly thought it was like the same guy too. And I, I'm kind of still unsure, but it's not the same guy. <laughs> yeah, he's a little weird. Oh. Just a little. Here I heard the bloody sounds of a smackdown. You're not looking, are you? Tell me you're not. No. Huh? I'm, I'm, I'm not Let leaking me. the Hunchback of Notre Dame. I know he's got a name, but I can't remember. Like, off the top of my head, I cannot remember. All right, doggy, you're coming with me. My boogie's just over here. And I name you Dog because of the fact that Max really shouldn't name anything ever um, because Max's son's name was Sprog, and then he named the dog Dog. So that should probably give you a hint as to he should never, ever name things. Easy, dog. So put the dog in the back. Easy. And then I'm going to drive. Rev it up and go, Sink. The buggy's humble, but she can haul. All right, I gotta get on the other side because apparently this is. Um... All right, awesome. So now I gotta get used to driving in this game again. Sooner I get my car back, the sooner I'll be on my way. Which Whoa. the. Amen. Huh? Whoa. Okay, yeah, I gotta get used to this driving again. But I, I do. I absolutely love it. Oh, okay. Well, never mind. I'm just going to flip the car. That's cool, too, right? I feel really good. Oh, yes, boy. From that looky look point, we may be able to spot your car. Oh, okay. You can see the camp from up there without risk of detection. Follow Chum to the lookout point. I mean, he did say up there. I mean, I could have just walked there. But okay. Whatever's, bruh. Over here. Come, over. Come look. All right. I'm coming. Yeah, see, this is where the thick brow squat cut. Watch us. Aim for the road. I'm gonna... oh, yeah, look. There. Scabber, Scott, this is... And I fucking love the name. Yeah. 
Scabrous Scrotus, one of the sons of Immortan Joe, and uh, I think he's the head of Gastown until you kill him, and then after that, that's when uh, the People Eater takes over. I love the lore, and I love the names from this game, or from this series. Just Mad Max is probably one of my favorite series of all time. They took my car. Fast. Faster than fear. Tougher than an iguana's gonads. Well, I mean, that's pretty tough. That is pretty tough. Anybody who's had experience with iguana's gonads should know that it's pretty tough. When you see what I'm gonna show you, you'll be shouting holy all day long. Oh, really? Good. I do like the fact that he's basically in a, uh, he's basically, oh, just hit now. Okay, so like L zooms in. Oh, there we go. Nice. All right, so we can close the binoculars. All right, so we need to go to his, uh, all right, cool. We just need to go to his sanctum. And then we will figure out that we have to go and uh, build the magnum opus. Yeah, I mean, that's true. This is just a really cool, like, dried out ocean bed and stuff like that. So we got Chum Bucket's hideout. Now, I'm immediately going to change the car as soon as I possibly can to something that looks really, really cool, but... Oh, yeah? Well, I'm going to run up here real quick. Mostly because I can't remember... I know you have to collect all kinds of stuff. You have to collect water, and I just fell. Okay, cool. I'm just going to fall the rest of the way. Sure, that sounds good. Sometimes the controls get a little... uh wonky uh there is that problem there's also the problem that i mean while he looks a little bit like max he still kind of doesn't it's like this weird cross between gibson's max or gibson's max and uh, hardy's max magnum opus mm, yes well, I mean, I mean, it kind of looks like a pile of shit right now, but you know. This ain't no car. It's just a mess of parts. No, no, no. She's knowledge from the numinous, divinely inspired. She wills herself upon this world. Sure. Look. See here, divine meets trishaft and a symbiosis of faith. I love the way they talk. So with that old time religion, huh? We got a classic whammy turbo high dog. Huh? Hell yeah! Bulletproof and torture tester, statically upgraded with chum bucket overdrive. <laughs> That's Springs, chum bucket overdrive. Sucks. Links too. It's gonna be ice soon. There's nothing less. Yeah. We will get there. Yes. First, we have to get her beautiful body. Show me where it is. A beautiful yes. body. Come. No time like the present. Come on, say. We must go. All right. Time to go kick some people's asses and get ourselves a body. But I do have a couple of bodies that I can choose from already. Uh, I just need to figure out where I have to go. We will liberate her body from a place sad and strange where the chariots of old went to well, die. Where are we going? Just tell me where we're going. The graveyard. Yeah. All right. Okay, well, we there must we go. go in the dead of night. The buzzard guardians are away on their wild hunt. All right. So let's see. There's a scavenging location there. Uh, and, like, uh, when, when we get into the bigger parts of the map where there's, like, a whole bunch of stuff that we have to deal with, because the map is pretty big, um, when we, when we get to, like, the nitty-gritty parts, I think I'm probably not going to record a lot of those, because I just, I just, I can't do it. Uh, but I do think that we're going to head over and, uh, before we go get the body, we're going to head over to the scavenging area real quick, if we can. Some of these scavenging areas are a little harder to deal with, but... Okay, so 
I think we can run in here and Keep just an kick, on the car. kick the ass of uh, whoever's in here. Oh, there we go. There we go. You want to skirt it? Yeah, there we go. Yep, just kick his ass. There we go. Nice. Nope. Fuck you. Fuck you. Fuck you. Fuck you. And fuck you. Well, thank you very much. All right, let's go ahead and pick up the scrap here. I think there's two scrap, right? Yep, there's two scrap. Uh, what does that say? Scavenging locations. Yeah, okay. Well, we already knew all that. So now we just got to find that other part, which should be around here somewhere. Uh, where is it? There it is. Nice. Just, I, I love the their toilets right there pretty much too. All right, so now we need to just drive to the graveyard. And uh, when I look at the map, uh, that should, like the red should clear up and turn into like a cleared area once we get like everything we can done. So we gotta go over and we're gonna get this body. And uh, yeah, I should have enough time in this video to get the body and uh, maybe do a couple other things. Whoop, whoop, whoop. Noise. Defeat eight enemies in, what? Did I actually hit someone? I literally didn't see anything. Okay, cool. Uh, we just got to drive to the Gravion. What's that up there? Oh, that's the place where they took my black on black. God damn bastards. We are low on fuel. Unfortunately, with gas time comes the blessings of gasoline. We should get <laughs> gasoline. Love this game. All right, so we got to find fuel for the Magnum Opus, which is going to be at either one of these places. Fuel cans. All right, let's run on over here. I don't remember if we have to fight people or not. I mean, it makes sense that we would have to fight people, but let me collect some scrap. Uh, this area has two scrap pieces, and it looks like we've got... Uh, empty. Ah, well, that's empty. Okay, well... Two scrap pieces. There's the other one. Noish. All right, cool. And uh, the the only problem is is like I do not like that the jump button is L two. Here is long gone now. Along with anything of use. All right, we gotta run on over here. Now, I mean, it does get to a point though where like I have definitely like I'm just gonna roll out of there. All right, come on, guys. Ow, that one hurt a little bit. Block that. Knock that guy fuck out. Bam! Max is a uh, pretty big badass. I'm just saying. All right, cool. So let's go ahead and pick up the scrap. There should be one. Yeah, there's... It seems like in... Okay, cool. I can ignite it. Uh, I think the last time when I first played it, I wasn't really paying attention and I ended up, like, igniting the thing. So, excuse me. Um, I really don't want to enter vehicle. Where is the gas tank on this? I forgot. Ignite, throw, ignite, throw, hold, drop... Uh Okay, well that's not the way that I want to do it. Oh my god. This is this is the the first hurdle is am I going to be able to actually put the gas in the tank? Uh okay, pick up the fuel can. All right. Now, I I got to go around the back cuz the okay, yeah, there we go. X. All the way to the brim. If I can remap those, those keys, I'm going to remap the fuck out of the keys to make it that the jump button is not the fucking L2 button. Why in the hell would you map it to L2? Okay. There should be... Well... Well, we will, but currently there should be one more... Yeah, okay. One more piece of scrap, and I punched the wall because I hit the wrong button to collect. Uh, okay, so let's go grab the other 
fuel can. And then we'll run on over and put this in the back. Store for later. Oh, let us make haste before the nightly hunters return to their lair. All right, so we need to head on over to the graveyard. And uh, once I get that, I'll probably go ahead and finish the episode. Because that seems like a pretty good place to, to stop. But, uh, but yeah, I mean, I freaking love this game. It's like... It's like the driving's like GTA 5 on steroids. And while it does get a little flighty here and there sometimes, I mean, sometimes you just gotta go with flight. Hey, shit. God damn it. I'm gonna fuck the car up before I even get to the point where I can actually do anything. Nobody around. Their gate unguarded. There's a lead set. Huh? One blast should split it wide open. All right, well, let's go ahead and destroy the gate then. Uh... So let's make this one count. Okay, by detonating a fuel can near the base. All right, so I want to ignite and then throw it. Nice. Uh, exaltation. She's cracked open. All right, now we got to go in and we got to find a car body. We must hurry. Wardens of this place murder on sight. Well, let's hope that that doesn't happen. Luckily enough. How can you tell? I also ran into every one of those the first time I played it. Whoop, there we go. That one's gonna explode because they lit it on fire. All right. I love it when you get like the sniper rifle and all that stuff. Which, sadly, I am going to have to do a lot of... Ah, I didn't. Uh, which, sadly, I am going to have to do a lot of, like, side stuff in order to get everything. But, like I said, I'm not going to bore you guys with all that. Whoop. There we go. Nice. Alright, so... Just driving through this, like, obstacle course of shit right now. For some reason, and the car goes like really fucking slow for a long time. Whoa! Go, 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 go. Shit! Shit! Oh, shit. Okay. Fuck, 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 fuck. Go, 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 go. No, 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 no. Don't look behind you. That's a bad idea. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Alright, there we go. I mean, every once in a while, if you just slightly tap it, you're gonna get fucked. And I really don't want to do that. All right, cool. This is where we need to be. And then I get to choose what the car is going to look like. And I, I don't know. I think the last time I chose, like, the hot rod body. But I don't know what I'm going to choose this time. But they all have their pluses and minuses. Okay, well. So we got to fight our way there? Is that what we got to do? These episodes might be a little longer too Get because the place down here. I'll lower the body onto it. But it because it, it does take a little bit to actually get to things. Oh good. Just got a couple of guys. Just got a couple of guys that, you know, disappear. They're just creepy little like red eyed dudes. It's all good. Alright, so let's go ahead and click the scrap. Okay, so there should be three scrap and I don't think I passed one yet. So maybe I could sit down this. You probably could. As long as we don't fall, that's fine. All right, cool. Flashlight. In. Let's collect the flashlight. <laughs> New bio. Flashlight. Do I really need to read what the flashlight does? Let's look at the bio for flashlight. Uh, no, that's not what I wanted. Is it tools and weapons? I'm already at 30-some percent. Let's read what the flashlight says. Not being able to see your enemy is a great disadvantage at night or inside poorly lit tunnels. This flashlight... Really? I mean, you had to tell me that? You just had to tell me that? Okay. Wait. Did I miss something? Okay. I thought I missed something there for a second. But the flashlight is uh, pretty useful. I just got to remember that I can turn it on and off. Like so. I don't think that there's a battery on it 
I think that that might have been a little bit too much of the... That might have been a bit too much maintenance for this game. But I can't wait until we get to, like, war... The, uh, like, the war criers and stuff like that. Ooh, hello. Let's fill my canteen with all of the water. Yes. I will become addicted to water. It's gonna happen. I'm gonna continuously use that as, uh... The phrase that I constantly use whenever I pick up water. So you guys should probably get used to that. It's a good question. All right, let's go ahead and we're going to pick which car. Which car? All right, so we got the furnace. We got shovel face. We got wild hunt. And Death Rat. And the Die Roller. Oh, maybe the Die Roller. The Die Roller looks really freaking cool. Um, uh, let's get the Die Roller. Die Roller sounds pretty good. And I think that's one of the uh, DLC things. So that should work. All right. So now we got the die roller, and we're gonna have to uh, roll a very quickly to evade. Okay, so RB that are too powerful. Okay. All right, cool. Uh, I can pick up this knife. Pick up this knife. There you go. There we go. I love getting the combos and shit. It's really cool. Come on, who's gonna try it again? Huh? Try it. Yeah, that's right. You break your goddamn leg. Ow. Okay. You hit me from behind. Okay. There we go. We get defeated the buzzards. Oh, we better get the fuck out of here, though. All right, we gotta we gotta get to the side. There we go. Run, run, run. Come on, man. I hate ladders in games. I hate them so much. All right, cool. Run over the car. Once we get out of this area, we're go I'm going to stop the video. Holy shit. I can't stop right there, though. There ain't no friggin' way. Oh. Okay, run. Okay. Uh, LB and B to aim and fire at that. Use X. Okay, so I gotta remember X and LB and B. There we go. Nice. nice. Oh, shit. I went the wrong way. Oh, well. Oh, okay. Apparently, I'm supposed to side ram him. Nice! The, ve the vehicular combat in this game is freaking awesome. Crisis. Cash and safe. Yes, creatures of the underworld. Don't hit me. I mean, I slowed down just so that, like, I could hit him, but... There we go. Well, there we go. Nice. Yeah! Magnum Opus. Chum Bucket calls it the Magnum Opus. It's not much of a car now, but it has potential. We found a body, but more work is needed before it's battle ready. Except for the fact that I just battled. We're alive and free of the graveyard. Wait, but something's loose. I can fix it now if you stop, or, or later, at my sanctum. Uh, it's your choice. Uh, go ahead. Stop. Oh, you can hit... Re okay. Repairs now. 
All right, so while Chum Bucket's fixing that, I think I'll go ahead and call the episode for now. Hopefully, you guys are enjoying the first episode. Uh, I am going to continue playing this because it's an amazing game. Uh, but anyway, thank you guys very much for joining me. I am Flog. Remember to hit that like button, comment, and of course subscribe. Are you gaming? Well, you should be. And don't get addicted to water. But I'll see you guys in the next one. Oh, bye bye.